tired on your daily stand-up, waiting on your turn? It's time to shake things up and tackle eight common daily stand-up challenges head-on with me, Rob. We've all been there, waiting on our turn during the daily stand-up, trying to recall what we did yesterday, frantically looking to our calendar to remember, enduring side discussions that derail the meeting. And let's not forget the hassle of trying to find the link to the video call to the board and writing on Slack, I'll be three minutes late all over again. Well, people, the struggle ends here. Today, I'll show you how to tackle the eight most common challenges of the daily. I'll show you how I run my signature walk the board daily stand-up using the new features and intelligent widgets on Miro's innovation workspace. And all of that without ever leaving Miro. Ready for the challenge? Like and subscribe and let's go! Hi, I'm Maria and this is the Agile State of Mind. Welcome! Today I'll show you how to tackle the eight most common daily stand-up challenges. With Miro's innovative tools and intelligent widgets, you can not only overcome these hurdles, but also gamify the experience just enough and keep you wide awake and engaged. Let's go! This video is sponsored by Miro. Problem number one. Having trouble finding the link to the Kanban board, Miro and all the places your team keeps their agreement. Well, here's the solution. Create a team space in Miro to keep everything organized. As you see, here we have our team space and you can add a new board right here. Ta-da! Just as easy. And you keep everything in one place. All right, problem number two. Constantly switching between different tools to track progress and they get easily outdated. You can import the Jira cards to your customized Kanban board here. As you see, I customized the board so changed a little bit the columns so they reflect our team columns to do developing validating done and here i imported as you see like this you can import all the jira issues and add them on the mirror board this way you keep them updated and here you can edit them as you see i enhanced a bit the kanban board so that it can have all the cool features and the widgets that are available on Miro now. Let's see how we can use them. Problem number three. Team members forget or lose sight of sprint goals and policies during the sprint, leading to misalignment and wasted time. How many times has this happened to us, right? As you see here, I added some places for sprint goal tracker, you can have your sprint goal here. If you have more than one, unfortunately that happens, you can add them here. And policies, we have SLE, service level expectation, five days. So we expect all the items to take around five days to finish with limit of five overall, not keeping it right now. And work item age, so we keep our eye on it. So those are our important policies and we keep them visible at all times. Problem number four. Difficulty in quickly estimating and adjusting story points for the tasks that arise mid sprint. Let's not kid ourselves that this never happens to us. You can now add your story points directly on the board. Let's add three here. As you see, they get updated directly. Ta -da! Problem number five. Deciding who will facilitate daily stand-ups can be time consuming and lead to confusion and huge documents with rotation. Get the spinner widget for fun and engaging way to facilitate your daily. You can find it here. You add the new spinner widget. As you see, you have this round. It will add it wherever you say it. And you add people here. So I already added a colleague. Let's spin it and see who comes up. Oops, 
Yeah, looks like I'm the next facilitator. You can use it for other things. Can decide for the next team building activity instead of adding people and add custom. As you see here, you can add escape room laser tag. If you can't decide within the team, the spinner will decide for you. Laser tag it is. That is super cool, isn't it? Adding gamification right on the spot during the daily. Problem number six. Do you keep getting assigned tasks or forget to pull in work you've already started? Increase ownership of the task at hand by letting people self-organize and add themselves to the task so they can pull them. You have this people widget, it then will show the whole team. And now might be the perfect time to refresh our memory on how to walk the board during daily stand-up, right? I have a video where I explain it thoroughly. You can check it here, it's walk the board video. And you can also check my Substack post about it. So, in a classic walk the board activity, you're not just keeping your eyes on the goal that we have here, but you're also actively managing the work in progress. How do we do that? Start by reviewing what's closest to completion and you move from right to left. Here we have those two columns that are work in progress. We review them and then we also can check sprinkled tasks that haven't been started. And this way you focus on finishing something every day. You can even add a powerful question. What can we finish today? And let the team self-organize to get it done. Teach them to swarm, pair up and work collaboratively. With Walk the Board you're not just keeping track, you're making sure nothing slips through the cracks. You know how it goes, we never check everything and then we have this kind of cue in a column which becomes a bottleneck. So what we do is we go one by one by everything that we have in progress and make sure it gets tackled and remembered. First daily might take a while, but after that you will see that you are actively unblocking and moving forward the tasks. Remember, only a stable system can be predictable and the golden rule is that only if you close something you can open something new. This way the rate ratio with, of closing is the same as the ratio of starting, so the work in progress remains stable, the same. So that's the golden rule, let's see how that applies. Walking the board exercise really helps to do it. And my favorite part here is that instead of managing people through the three boring questions and getting statuses from all of them, you manage the work. You look at the work, you manage the work, so the work gets done. Don't you just love it? And my cherry on top, problem number seven. Tired of searching for links, where is the video call link? And switching between apps and being late for the party. Start your daily stand-up directly from the Miro Innovation Workspace with a pop-up on the board. So if I start this video right here, I will just mute myself so you don't hear me. Yay, I'm here. You can now work, have a call directly from the board. Isn't that amazing? You can add more people. So right now what I can do, I can show you. As you see, woo, we have so many Marias here. You can move this widget wherever it works for you. You can add some filters as you see here. You can change them just by clicking on it. I really like, oh, this one with the yellow. And you can also change the, if it's horizontal or vertical, you can make it smaller, make it bigger. So this is a game changer. You, have, you didn't expect that, did you? And as you see, you will see that there is an active video call, so you just click on it and that's it. You only need one link for the whole daily. No more scrambling. And last but not least, problem number eight. Notice you have too many side conversations derailing your daily and it's lasting forever. Use parking lot to capture topics for later, minimize distractions and keep the meeting on track. So whenever a topic pops up, you add it to the parking lot 
and let's add some topics. So here I prepared some topics for discussion. Of course, it's uh, on one daily you probably have less than this. But after a week full of those discussions, you can then move them and put some actions, right? The actions that have been agreed and taken. After that, if you have those actions already, what you can do is create a summary of the topics discussed and actions taken for those who were missing on that daily. The document can be also reviewed on the retrospective. You have all the new tools here, as you see. You didn't see that coming, did you? As you see, Miro made a lot of significant advancements in its board and revealed them on the Canvas 24 annual event. I really believe those advancements done by Miro can transform the way we work and collaborate, which is the, my favorite thing to do. It does feel like taking the collaboration and working together to the next level. And as you know, I love helping teams collaborate, bring them together, create alignment. All these new features will be released progressively by Miro and you can explore them already. Go to miro.com slash innovation workspace and you will see everything that Miro has been cooking for us. And that's all for today. I hope the eight tips and tricks to solve for your daily stand-up challenges will help you take that meeting to the next level. Remember to like and subscribe and pop into my Substack for more agile hacks. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.